Betty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw an Aztec dragon. I take two fingers in the middle and I draw me a dot. And from that dot, I'm going to go to the left and draw a slightly curved line down. Go back to the dot. I'm going to draw to the right a slightly curved line down. I come back to the left and I continue curve line down, up, curve line, connect. I'm going to come in on the left hand side and I'm going to draw a curve line inside, keep going. And I'm going to come on the center part and I'm going to draw a curve line down, curve line up, connect. And I'm going to draw another curve line inside, up, connect. I come on the right hand side and I'm going to draw a straight line out, curve line, curve line, keep going, curve line, and bring it all the way up, connect. I come on the right hand, I mean the left hand side, and I'm going to draw a straight line out, curve line up, in, and stop. Right where I stop, I'm going to draw a curve line out, in, out, and stop again. I come back over to the left and inside here I'm going to draw a curve line around and then I am going to come inside and mimic this line and draw it around. Now I'm going to stop right here because I'm going to draw curve line down, up, straight line, curve line down, up, and stop. I'm going to come back in and connect straight line, straight line, connect. I come way over here on the left side and I draw a curve line down, curve line up, down, up, connect, and I'm going to add some triangles. Baby triangle one, triangle two, triangle three. I come back over to the left and I'm now going to join little curved line, jump over, little straight line, jump over, and now a big straight line all the way over, connect. Now I'm going to come in and I'm going to mimic these lines, curve line, curve line, and up, and connect, and I think those are all the lines I need. Oh, and one more right here, curve line, connect. It looks complicated, but once you draw it by sections, it's not too difficult to do, and the coloring is really easy. Let's see how we're going to color this. The first thing I'm going to do is color this section because this is my eye. And I'm also going to come down and I'm going to color this section black because this is the inside of my mouth. I take a brown crayon and I'm going to redraw all of the lines that I just drew because this is an Aztec sculpture made out of stone. So in order to give it a little bit of depth, I'm going to go ahead and outline every line that I just drew. And I'm going to make it with this darker brown all the way around. Keep going. Leave your teeth white, but come in. This is your tongue. Keep doing this one and follow it all the way around. This mouth line is very important because a lot of the sculptures have that. Bring it around. Now with a lighter color I can fill in 
pretty much the whole entire section of my dragon. Okay. Let's see what he looks like all colored in. Here is my Aztec dragon all colored in. You can find these in stone all around Mexico City, different places in Mexico, on the pyramids and the temples. Okay, bye-bye.